Hey everyone, welcome back to Pause From Plays Metroid Dread. Alright, so we can't go through the uh, super wide beam door. Um, which means we have to go back through Emmy area, which um kind of hate. Because that thing, this one is particularly nasty. Um... I appreciate those for being, uh, platform-shaped. Okay. Really? Okay. Um... Somehow, we're not dead. Which is great. That's going to be a problem. <laughs> um, hmm. Yeah, that's pretty bad. We can't go there. Oh, we almost had it, actually. You know what? We're just going to die. How about that? I tried it. Um, hmm. Okay. This one is very unpleasant. I mean, we want to go. We don't really want to go out this way. Maybe we have to? Yeah, that's, that's like really exceptionally terrible. Okay, we made it out. Yes, I might have been holding my breath for that last bit there. Don't judge me. I- oh, whoa, hey. Why don't you just sell- you are- you immune to being frozen. Oh, that's unpleasant. Alright, we can open this. This is a shortcut so we don't have to go through the Emmy area. Hmm. How much, how much do we have left? Oh my god. Yeah, I think we might actually have to go back that way. This seems kind of obvious. Oh, that's not really what I was hoping for, though. There is something over there, though. What is... What do we got here? Nothing. Oh. Okay, how do we... That's intro. We can't... Yeah, whatever these are, we... We can't do anything with them yet. Man, that guy's just a big old pile of... Let me guess, you're gonna be like, uh... Oh. Really? No trick? Alright. Look at that, free missiles. Pretty nice.
Oh, um, that is highly unexpected. It was not planning for a boss. Oh, you are electrified. You are not electrified anymore. You are intensely mean. Can you be frozen? I mean, I'm for sure dead here, but... Yeah. Uh, hmm. It's also interesting because we're getting mini-bosses now. Previously, those doors have been exclusively bosses. Like, actual health bar bosses. Alright, so we can't do that. Ah, I forgot that it explodes. Oh, it, it shocks the floor, too. Oh, those completely... Uh, what? Hello, yes, you counter everything I do? Could you not? It's, it's kind of an interesting conundrum because I find it easier to fire a charge shot than I do to fire a missile against this, control-wise. Which it really shouldn't matter, right? I think that's, I think that's the trick. I just need to... Oh. I just need to do jump shots. Instead of trying to... Hell of a shot. Can't be mad at that. See, the other thing is that, like, you're, you're a mini-boss, you should be dead. And I am very disappointed that you are not deceased. Okay, there we go. Oh, it's the... Oh, we haven't seen one of these in some way since Fusion, right? Um, can only be hit a certain time? Okay, I think it's, it's got invincibility frames. Storm Missile? The hell is that? Okay. Oh, that fills our other missile slot. Lock. Uh, up to five targets. Three units of missile ammo per target. Also effective against enemies collecting electrical energy. That can trigger storm missile boxes. That's probably what those. Maybe that's what the. Uh, so, first of all, that's our ultra-wide beam, right? This is what I'm gathering there. Don't, don't put enemies here. Not... Okay, I mean, I guess that's why you put enemies there. What? 
What is interesting, though, is this poses a, a really interesting control dilemma. I feel like I'm, I'm kind of going a little overboard on control complaints. I mean, don't get me wrong, this controls very well. Um, but... Oh. Uh, the problem is now is that I can't prep ice missiles. If I do, they become storm missiles. Which is uh, troublesome. Okay. Good news is, means we can go, I mean, I, I guess, and we have to go here. We don't really have a choice. So I'm probably honestly better off just going out this door. Oops, did not mean that. Yeah, because what happens? I guess you can still be destroyed by that. Very satisfying sound effects, though. I'm certainly going to chew through missiles really fast that way. Yeah, that is a, it is a very interesting problem. Boy, that thing really is just in the worst place. Okay, we're out. Well, uh, oh, so we don't open the doors directly. We have to open them by hitting all the switches. I see. That's cool. You know what's really interesting about this too, by the way? Um, I, I've been thinking about this since we started. When we played uh, that Metroid Prime 2D demo, I was like, oh man, look how cool that animation for aiming around is. The same animation here. <laughs> Very similar. I mean, because, you know, it, on one hand, how else would you do it? But, uh,. It's it's a good animation. Okay. Uh, I want to go up. Can't. Oh, do we have to? Why didn't I go through there? Was there? <laughs> Maybe there was something that pushed me out of that direction previously. I don't recall, to be honest. Alright, there's an ominous pause. Oh, that's right, this room. I was afraid of this room. Two of them, huh? Uh, get missile locked? Okay, so if we get hit, it uh, disables the missile lock, but, oh jeez, we can lock onto these guys multiple times. Which means we do a lot of damage. Definitely trying to still get in the hang of the uh, the spin jump boost. The timing on it is, is very precise. It feels like old space jump. If that makes any sense. If you played uh, Super Metroid. It's not space jump. All right, that was power bombs, which we have. We have a power bomb. We just, oh, we can open this now. Maybe that's power bombs.
Power bombs? Space jump. Okay. Well, maybe that solves that other problem. Repeatedly during a spin jump. The right uh, right time. Nuts. It's still a timing thing. Yeah, it's it's actually... If I seem to recall a space jump, it's always that you have to start descending. If you don't... Yeah, if you hit it at the, the top of your jump, then... It doesn't, uh, doesn't do anything for you. Sorry, friends. Alright, so we can make it across here. I'm assuming. The proper space jump. Okay. Except some of those were still alive and I did not realize. Okay. No problem. Okay, I don't know where that went, unfortunately. Alright, and we're out. So... Now we can go through here? Yeah, there must have been some reason we didn't go that way before. Or maybe there wasn't, and it uh, yeah. It would have just been blocked had we tried it. And now we can go for a hundred percent map. We're not gonna do that. Just putting that out there right now. Uh, there's also an item. Somewhere? that item is uh, if you think for a second I'm gonna bomb jump all the way up there you out of your damn mind. But maybe we can go around. This, this seems like um, an uncomfortable amount of work for what is probably just a single missile expansion. But at the same time, we're also burning missiles like crazy now. I guess you would have to. Oh, come on. Really? Please. I guess you have to come in from the bottom? No, we're not doing. We're not doing that. Alright, back around we go.
Yep, should've seen that one coming. It's like if we're trying to shortcut it. Nice little refill there. Oh. oh, they're going to combine. How about that? Ice territory, that's why I hadn't gone in there. Well, that tells me that we're not even supposed to be here. There's one there, and that's a tell. Oh, no, it's teleport the other direction. We don't know what that is. Power bombs. Um, the other thing is too is there might be some. Space jump areas. I mean, for sure that is something. So we could go to Gavaran. Could also go to Dairon. Nice. That's probably space jump. Right, so we, we need to go, uh, we need to travel, the short version. All right, those are drop blocks. Yeah, get me the heck out of here. You can retain speed booster while space jumping, so that's good to know. Alright, I'm actually going to save you watching the loading screen this time. Alright, and we're back. Yeah, it's not an insignificant loading screen. So, first things first, we can't do that. What was the first one? It was in, in Dairon? You know what? Maybe I'll just travel there and then unpause. Just, just I know I just paused, but thinking like, it's quite a, that's a lot of place to go. All right, so, uh, turns out, uh, I can't do that. Uh, if I can go to the map real quick, uh, the short version is all this stuff is blocked. All these doors closed. It's hard to even pinpoint where they all are, but short version is I, I can't go that way. Let's see if Adam has anything more to say here. Nope. Okay. Uh, I can go back to Dairon, I think, but it has to be a different way. I think I have to come down here. Past this uh, horrendous missile tank. I mean, realistically, I could also go through one of these. 
But I think what I'm going to do is I'm just actually just going to end up pausing here. And then we'll uh, continue next time. And so, yeah. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Take a click like. Helps a bunch. Subscribe for more. And I'll see you soon.